Und damit, okay, Leute, was geht ab und herzlich willkommen zurück zu The Stanley Parable 2. Ihr wisst Bescheid, wo wir sind. Und letztes Mal war... Wo ist der Aufzug hin? Letztes Mal war ein bisschen weird. Aber wir sind back. Manche würden sagen, wir sind back. Wir rücken auf Englisch. Hat sich irgendwas verändert? Weiß ja nicht. Sammelgegenstand vielleicht. Collect them all? Nee. Äh. Also. Dann. Keine Ahnung. Gehen wir erstmal wieder diesen normalen Weg lang zu dem Loch. Um. Oh. Das ist seltsam. Das ist jetzt zu. Okay. Falls ihr die letzte Folge verpasst habt, wir haben mit Hundewelpen in einem Loch gechillt. Wenn man das so ausdrücken kann. Sehr, sehr skurril. Schaut euch gerne die letzte Folge an. Ist bei Minute 6 irgendwann oben links verlinkt. Wird machen eigentlich. Talk denn da niemand zu mir? Aber das ist halt seltsam. Wisst ihr, so niemand talkt zu uns. Alles hier ist tiefenentspannt. Das ist nicht normal. Der Jump Circle ist immer noch bei Null. Äh Vielleicht hat sich hier oben was getan. Ja, hier, das sieht gut aus. Da waren wir das letzte Mal auch schon, aber das letzte Mal konnten wir nicht. Ja, warum? Ähm... Ich dachte, ich hätte was gehört, was in den Lüftungsschächten ist. Hallo? Wieso talkt der nicht mehr zu uns? If you Jim. only played along, Jim. that would have been Jim. your name, the button Jim. says. Jim. But no. Jim. Instead, Jim. Oh, Jim. I can't Jim. even think Jim. about it. I'm Jim. taking the Jim, Jim button away. Jim. 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 Okay, tschüss. Hä? Was, was, was will er denn jetzt hier? Er soll sich mal hier ein bisschen beruhigen, sag mal, das ist mein Knopf, ja? Mit meinem Namen. Ich hab keine Ahnung, was ich hier machen soll. Ganz ehrlich nicht. Will ich das nochmal scannen? Eigentlich nicht. Ihr könnt das aber gerne nochmal scannen. Ich warte kurz, drück Pause, scannt das. Und schaut euch Stanley Parable 2.com an. Bürodekoration hatten wir schon. Der Knopf. Ja, den, Spiel, den Namen des Spiels. Kann hier vielleicht nochmal auf Knöpfchen. Der Ballon. Da unten. Der sollte vielleicht auch zu den anderen da oben. Vielleicht, wenn wir jetzt das Spiel neu starten, sind da auf einmal Ballons. Too easy, I can't. That's a... Ja. Ich bin überfordert. Ausgang. Ja. Wir kennen alles. Lass mal da lang gehen. Alright. Have you seen everything you wanted to? Ja. Ready to move on now? Ja. 
Habe ich schon mal gesagt, dass das alles sehr fiebertraumartig wirkt? No screen. So Stanley, what do you think? Do you like all of the new features? Yes, I know it's not exactly clear. Ja, also die Collectibles sind ganz okay. Das unendliche Loch feiere ich. It's going to work. There's definitely a Aber sonst gab es sehr langweilige Sachen. I'll arrange these new features together and we'll see whether or not it coheres into a meaningful gameplay experience. Hm. Ja. John, zeig doch mal. Okay. Are you ready? Here it is. I give you the Stanley, Stanley Parable, Parable 2. Um, that's a collectible. Well, um, I mean, there's potential here, right? It's sort of okay. Never mind. Hold on. Let me do a different arrangement. Ich werde collectible. Yes, yes. This is much better. I feel good about this. Here we go. Version two. Ta-da! <sighs> Who am I kidding, Stanley? This isn't a coherent video game at all. It's a lot of gags. And I do very much enjoy creating gags, but they don't add up to anything. I stand that drauf, ich hab's nicht gelesen. To create a sequel that would capture all the magic of the first game. Ja, und was das erste Spiel besonders gemacht hat, ich no feier das so total. Are, they wouldn't stand on their own. They would need the structure and the gameplay of the original. Wait. Maybe that's it. I can take the original Stanley Parable and simply, well, insert a few of my new features into it. Tastefully, of course. With respect, with care for the vision and integrity of the original game. Would it possibly work? I suppose it could. But it would need a really, really tremendous title screen. A title screen that says with bold and uncompromising conviction, this is the Stanley Parable 2. Let me see if I can whip something up. <laughs> All right, perfect. Go ahead. Take a look. Wir sind jetzt nicht. Ich glaube, wir haben kranken Progress gemacht. Lass uns mal hier durchschauen. Ah, mh, ja. Mh, 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 mh. Ja, ja. Ja, oh, ja. Wieso nur 59? Ja, hallo. Ah, sonst alles. Ja, Steuerung, ja. Ja. Ja? Jetzt will ich Innovation hier. This is the story of a man named, named Stanley. Stanley. Stanley worked for a company in a big es ist neu, es ist geupdatet. Wir schauen uns das Intro noch mal an. So, aber ich glaube, vom Reden her macht er einfach ganz genau das gleiche wie vorher auch. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on a keyboard. Ja. Orders came to him through a monitor on his desk, telling him what buttons to push, how long to push them. And in what order? This is what employee 427 did every day of every month of every year. Ja. And although others might have considered it soul rending, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came in, as though he had been made exactly for this job. And Stanley was happy. Ja. Ach. And then one day, something very peculiar happened. Something that would forever change Stanley. Something he would never quite forget. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for him to find. Nein! No one had showed up to give him instructions, Was? Or call a meeting, or even say hi. Nein. Never in all his years at the company had this happened. This complete isolation. Something was very clearly wrong. Shocked, frozen solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, he got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting. Also, Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Wir haben progress. Stanley picked up the bucket. Ganz wichtig, Leute. Wieso ist jetzt eine Absperrung? Finde ich jetzt aber nicht schön. Da muss ich jetzt außen rumlaufen, sag mal. Aber ich muss schon sagen, 10 von 10. 
Da war immer neuer Content hier hinten. Ist jetzt aber nicht mehr so. Weil wir sind jetzt im neuen Spiel. Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his chest and entered the door on his left. Nee, mein nicht. This was not the correct way to the meeting room. But Stanley had felt the bucket calling to him. Telling him that the employee lounge was simply the place to be. And here it was. Had the bucket turned out to be correct? Was this better than the meeting room? Yes, Stanley thought to himself. Yeah. Yes, perhaps it truly was. How insightful the bucket turned out to be. No, never mind. The bucket was wrong. Stanley took the door on his left to go back to the meeting room. Äh. Äh. Weiß ich nicht. Nee, wir gehen da lang. No, said the bucket. Don't go to the meeting room. Go somewhere else. The cargo lift, yes. Go there. Go to the cargo lift. Ähm. Darunter kommen wir nicht. Da ist ein Collectible! Hier! OMG. For real yet? You found one of them. One of the miniature Stanley figurines. For real, das game no hat gerade aufgelevelt. Das, le das, das, das. Only the intrinsic pleasure of a job well done. You can't buy that sort of happiness, Stanley. God knows I've tried. Hey, we play the same game. It's a thousand times better. Come one of these beautiful figurines. I will not play it to 100 percent. I need to play it again. Is he after death? Ich lasse jetzt mal straight up hier durchgehen. Oh. Das, so was habe ich erwartet. Okay, da lang. Ja, spannend. Kann es sein, dass der Typ hier die ganzen Kassetten auf... Wisst ihr, was ich meine? So dieses... This is a story about a man at Stanley. This is day number 295. Date number... I don't even know. I've lost track. Nothing feels real anymore. The longer I study this bucket, the less sense... Anything makes the sheer euphoria I feel every time I pick it up. No matter how many times I've done it, it's always the same feeling. Top game. Also, rein vom emptiness in my chest. Baut sich auf. It doesn't make sense. There's no explanation for it. I still haven't figured out why I see the world so differently when this bucket is in my arms. This is so good. Everything feels so. What do I do with this treasure? I can. I can monetize it. Yes, it's unthinkable the amounts of money people will pay for me in just an hour. Yeah, you know the shit, yeah. With the bucket, this is my golden ticket. But I have to be careful because as soon as this gets out, there's going to be a target on my back. Even now, I don't know who might be trying to get me. What's that? Who's there? Camarada. What?
All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Steht sogar da. Stanley lifted the bucket into his arms, and a wave of comfort rushed over him. Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his chest and entered the door on his left. Ja, hab ich. Oh mein Gott, war das gerade weird. There will be a reward for Ich würde die auch ganz gerne finden, die Collectibles, aber auf der Toilette vom Chef. Verblätter Dunkelheit. Wahrscheinlich der aus der Expo. Das E ist gelb. Weiter. Thank you. Noch weiter danach? In der Red Room ist ja unten. Coming to a staircase, Stanley and the Bucket walked upstairs to the boss's office. Is the Red Room? Yeah. Another miniature Stanley. Okay. Figurine. This um, you know. There really must be a ich will alle, Mann, das, das ist so richtig catchy, ihr glaubt das gar nicht. Um, what about Stanlerines? Yes, I think I like that. Another Stanlerine under your bed. Stanlerine, okay. Um, ich gehe trotzdem nach oben, weil das Rote wusste ich und das oben, äh, beim Chef, weiß ich auch. Hier. Because the boss know what the boss says goes if the boss suffered lose. Okay, okay, I'm going back to the name of these little Stanley figurines. Yeah. And now I'm torn between Stanlerines and Figlies. What do you think, Stanley? What name better encapsulates the intrinsic sense of happiness that you get from seeing a small number in the corner of your screen go up by one? Hey, that's it's cool. It. It's, sure it's it rewarding. Dopamine cleared. Extreme Bathrooms. So, jetzt müsste ich mich aber trotzdem genauer umschauen. Im Aufzug ist nichts. Der Aufzug macht ja permanent das Gleiche. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Crushed by the weight of this revelation, Stanley may have broken down into an emotional dumpster fire if not for the soothing presence of the bucket. Even now, in his darkest of hours, did the bucket's warmth... Fortsetzung ist jetzt pausiert. Ganz kurz, ich muss ganz kurz uh, nachgucken. Warte, kann ich euch nicht, kann ich das nicht zeigen. Ich gucke ganz kurz nach, in, äh, beziehungsweise wann wir das erste Mal diesen Text eingegeben haben. Ja, ja hey ho, du da draus. Und? Ja, nervig. Ähm, wo ist denn dieser Boss? Waren wir nie in dem Raum vom Boss? Okay. Aber im zweiten bestimmt. Zwei nach unten. Bin nachher auch nach oben gegangen. Ernsthaft? Wann waren wir denn das erste Mal in dem Büro vom Boss? Eben, ich suche das gerade raus, damit ich die Nummer einfach habe. Hier. Eight, four, five. Wir waren gar nicht mal so 2845. Ich gebe das jetzt ein. The guiding light pierced the dark clouds of confusion and chaos. 
It would be with him, but Stanley guessed the correct code by sheer luck. Was it the Natürlich, rein zufällig. Was the bucket guiding him? Oh, dieser Eimer, ey. Yes. This is certainly the most logical explanation. Ja. Der Eimer. Haben wir hier schon mal? Das ist auch so eine Sache. Ich... Nein! Nein, nein, habt ihr es gesehen? Da war eine Stanley-Figur. Nein, es... Stan, Stanley Gur, nein. Elevator race downward. Nein, 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 nein. Du sollst das nochmal machen. Plummeting towards an unknown fate. In Spiel erneut beginnen. Müsste funktionieren. All of his oh. is gone. What could it Seht ihr auch, wie viele Stanley-Figuren wir haben? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps the confusion and the chaos all seem to melt away. Ja, wir laufen straight up einfach zu jetzt, ohne groß zu überlegen. 2, 8, nee. 4, 8. Oh mein Gott, wie schlecht bin ich? Zwei, acht, vier, nee, acht, fünf. 2, 4, 8, 5. Ich gucke ganz kurz, ob der unten zuerst ist. Stanley und der Bucket walked upstairs to the boss's office. Wir haben ihn schon collected. Okay, das bleibt gesaved. 2, 4, 8, 5. Oder 4, 2, 8, 5. Wir haben jetzt. Wir können es probieren. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Crushed by the weight of this revelation, Stanley may have broken down into an emotional dumpster fire, if not for the soothing presence of the bucket. Even now, in his darkest of hours, did the bucket's warmth and guiding light pierce the dark clouds of confusion and chaos. Is he yeah. with him always? The bucket would. And he knew it. The two of them were inseparable. At this point, Stanley was so absorbed in the tender spiritual connection he shared with the bucket. Bin ich gerade wirklich so blöd? Bin ich gerade wirklich so blöd oder ist der Code anders? Zwei, acht, vier, fünf. Sag mal, wie blöd bin ich eigentlich? Sorry, aber... ...that he didn't notice the keypad behind the boss's desk. Nor in his bliss of simple... ...but Stanley guessed the correct code by sheer luck. Was it the bucket... Ja, hab ich gemerkt. ...was the bucket guiding him? Yes, this is certainly the most logical explanation. You're getting close now, Stanley. You really got off, an old guys, the Sigma Marines. Very soon, you'll collect the last one. Yeah. And then the first number will equal the second number. And that will be it. Ah. We'll be different people by then. Different in the sense that we used to have none of them. And now we have them all. You can't go back to when you had no Figler and Marines. None of us can. Ich finde, das ist ein cooles Gimmick mit diesen sammelbaren Gegenständen. So. Jetzt machen wir unten ganz normal weiter. Ja. Ich schreibe mir den jetzt auf, den Code. The ja. elevator raced downward, plummeting towards an unknown fate. It would be all Stanley could do to keep himself together, if not for the bucket. Soothing him, comforting him, reassuring that in this Ja, ja, lass mich doch jetzt runter hier schneller. He would be right. The bucket is here for you, Stanley. Everything will be fine. Was würde passieren, wenn ich wieder hochfahre? Stanley and the Bucket walk straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Ich glaube, ich bin drauf rein. Ich will eigentlich nur kurz rein wieder rausgehen. Egal. The lights rose on an enormous room packed with television screens. What horrible secret did this place hold? Stanley and the Bucket both wandered to themselves. Alles auf jeden Fall kaputt hier. Bisschen seltsam. Aber immerhin weiß ich, dass wir Progress gemacht haben. The monitors jumped to life and Stanley nearly dropped the Bucket in shock. Das ist sus. Everyone in the office was being videotaped. 
monitored like guinea pigs. The bucket had never seen anything like this and it very nearly burst das into auch tears. Da, das Rote. It gently, reassuring it that everything would be fine. Ja, das ist Sass. Das ist broken. Dann noch näher hingehen, was sieht man dann? Ist auf jeden Fall seltsam. Mind control facilities influence as well. Had the bucket been told to do things, it didn't wish to do. An die ganze Geschichte dreht sich nur noch um den Eimer. Also möchte ich einfach nur mal an der Stelle anmerken. Wir sind jetzt bei The Bucket Parable Ultra Deluxe. Ich meine The Bucket Parable 2. Oder The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe 2. Bucket Edition? I don't know. Ich finde es aber mega witzig. His one friend in the entire world. At this point, he could trust no one except for the bucket. But here was the proof. The heart of the operation. Controls labeled with emotions. Happy or sad or content. Walking, eating, working. All of it monitored and commanded from this very place. Es ist alles so seltsam. Of his past began to sink in. Stanley decided that this machinery would never again exert its terrible power over another human life. For he and the bucket would dismantle the controls for good. Two best friends, Stanley and the Bucket, up against the world. They high-fived in a really cool way, and the Bucket made a sassy comment about taking down the system. Yeah. But at the last second, the Bucket jumped in and pressed the button to turn on the controls. Stanley gasped in horror. Had this been the Bucket's plan all along? To take over the machine and claim Even the power for passiert. itself? How could the bucket have betrayed him like this? Stanley was prepared to throw the bucket away in disgust when suddenly an image appeared upon the enormous screen. Birds. Silly, silly birds. The control buttons became active again. Hey, I have was ganz anderes erwartet. Was ist mit dem Game? Uh, yeah, that's it. Stanley flipped through one video of silly birds after another, and then it dawned on him. This wasn't a mind control facility at all. It was a facility for monitoring and surveilling silly birds all over the world. I don't trust this! The mind controls were only a facade to disguise its true intentions. Had the bucket known this all along? Stanley marveled at the metal genius in his hands, the one who had pointed him towards this incredible discovery. Stanley and the Bucket never found freedom because they spent the rest of their lives here in this place, flipping through live streams of the silliest birds imaginable. Of all the possible paths his life could have taken, this one was surely the best. And Stanley was happy. Yeah, I've been happy. Nah. That's was. Der Progress ist da. Keine Ahnung. Äh, Wenn es euch gefallen hat, lasst ein Like bzw. einen Eimer nach oben da. Und schaltet beim nächsten Mal wieder ein. Es wird weird.